Welcome to NFL Imperialism. Before we begin the video, shout out to Dean's World for this amazing idea. I have two random wheels, a wheel with everybody's name on it. I'll click this time just for an example. This is not going to affect the actual thing. So for instance, this landed on the Rams. Then we have a random arrow that's going to point us in one direction. We look at our map here the Rams, but just say they go to the east, then we would have to put the Rams at the Raiders in the Madden simulator. And if Rams would've won, they would've taken over the state, they would now own their state. If there's a team like the Minnesota Vikings and just say it goes west to one of these states that does not have a team, they just take over that state. We keep on going until only one team's left. Let's go ahead and let's get started. Who are we gonna get first? It's going to be the Bears. And they'll be headed to the, like, the west, a little bit south. We're going to have to battle the Kansas City. Not the best start for them, but we'll see what happens. Bears put up a little bit of a fight, but in all, the Kansas City Chiefs win. Goodbye, Bears. We'll see you on the flip side as the Kansas City Chiefs take over Chicago. Then their um, territory or battle is going to be the New Orleans Saints going northwest-ish. think that's going to run into the Texans. The New Orleans Saints going into Houston. I don't even remember the last time I've seen the Houston Texans score 41 points in a row. Like, you picked on the wrong one, Saints. And y'all are going to pay for it. Now we got two teams so far expanding their territory. This time it's going to be the Cincinnati Bengals. So we haven't got any repeat teams yet, which is really good. So they'll go about northeast-ish. That'll probably run into the Browns. So Browns on the goal line here at the two-yard line. If they get a touchdown, they have a pretty good chance of winning. Deshaun Watson staying in the pocket, rolls, and is in for the touchdown. Browns go up by three with a field, with an extra point penny. Deshaun Watson takes a knee, and the Browns pull off a surprise win against the Bengals. And they will be eliminated from the map. Actually surprised about that one. I want the Bengals to go kind of far. Can we get a team just to go into a normal blank sp space this time? Maybe with the Washington Commanders straight down. They might get Virginia straight down, I think. Take some land here actually the smart thing to do next up is going to be the carolina panthers the team right next to washington so the washington commanders might not have it so easy they are going into virginia to take on the washington commanders uh oh washington commanders are kind of trying to come back nope the carolina panthers score a touchdown but the, the Washington Commanders score another touchdown. They are kind of relentless here, but they fall just short. The Carolina Panthers will win and take over Virginia. Bam and bam. So now the Panthers have the most states, actually. Not the biggest amount. Next up is going to be the Denver Broncos, actually. I thought it was going to be the Kansas City Chiefs, but it's the Denver Broncos. And the Denver Broncos will be going straight down, just about. We're trying to go from, like, the middle of the state. They're going to get some land here with app, without having to battle anybody. Always a good thing for that team. New York Jets going somewhere. The Jets are kind of in an interesting position because I think they have teams like all around them in New York. And straight to the left. Is that going to be the Bills? Yeah, I think that does land on the Bills if you go from the center of it. And that is going to be over the Buffalo Bills. Knock off the New York Jets 31-3. to That's literally the worst way you could have gone, New York. I'm sorry. Take them off the map. The San Francisco 49ers are next. And towards the leftish, I think that's actually C. But the closest state to that is right above them. Not sure what state it is. So they'll just go ahead and take that land over. Oh, we have the Chiefs again. They will be going to the north. Actually, go from the logo. I think it's a lot better. But I'll go from the logo. Uh, the Jacksonville Jaguars this time. They are in Florida. I think they're at the top of Florida, so they can either go up or down. This is headed more down. If it's not a space to the left, I'm pretty sure it isn't, though. Yeah, they'll go straight down and face the Tampa Bay Buccaneers in a Florida battle. I'm kind of expecting this to actually be a kind of a close game. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers are going to take care of the Jacksonville Jaguars. Sorry, Jacksonville. Was kind of hoping you would win. But y'all don't. Our right, next is going to be the New York Giants. If they go left, they have to face the Buffalo Bills. They go straight down. Actually, never mind. They have to face the Buffalo Bills. They go straight down. I'm not expecting that at all. The Giants hold the Bills to three points, and they beat them 23 to three. Shout out to the New York Giants fans. Goodbye, Buffalo. Next is going to be the Raiders. They're going to go up against. I'm guessing the Rams. Yeah, we're going to say the Rams here. The Rams are completely looking like crap here. <laughs> I don't understand what's happening. Yeah, I thought it would be a close game. Next, we're going to have the Dallas Cowboys. Let's see which way they go. They go about northeastish here. End up claiming some unclaimed land. 
Next is going to be the Detroit Lions going southwest to take on the Indianapolis. It's like the Colts end up beat the Lions, so they'll take over their territory. Kind of sad to see them go this soon, but we'll go back to the wheel. And this time, we'll have their division rival with the Houston Texans. Maybe we'll get the Battle of the Texans here, and we will. Looks like the Cowboys will be taking over the whole Texas land here. Goodbye, Texans. Next is going to be the Tennessee Titans going north here they'll claim some unclaimed land and we'll head back south again to the falcons going about south and they'll also claim some unclaimed land next is going to be the seattle seahawks going straight up here we're going to say that that's closer to the san francisco 49ers than it is the unclaimed land the san francisco drive all the way down the field runs out the clock the 49ers will take this win it was a close game though very close take the seattle seahawks off of the board here yeah, San Francisco definitely has a lot of land here. Next team up is going to be, we're going to get the Giants again. E yes. After having a crazy upset win against the Buffalo Bills. Let's see where they go next. If we do from the logo, they'll just expand their territory a little bit here. It's going to be the Pittsburgh Steelers. It's going to be going to the West. It's very close. I'm gonna say it hits the Browns barely, I think. Not After defeating the Bengals, they get the upset it, I guess, by the um, Steelers. This is the first time we had the Steelers and they expand their territory. We're gonna get the, no, we're gonna get the Titans, but they're gonna be going kind of northeast. I think that's gonna point to Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh is gonna be playing twice in a row here. Steelers knock off their second team in a row and get a pretty Shots Can that be the underdog team we see here, the Pittsburgh Steelers? You never know here on the NFL imperialism. This is going to be the Indianapolis Colts again, or is it the Chiefs? That's very close, but it's going to be the Colts. They've knocked off Detroit already. Let's see what they go next. Pretty much straight down. Oh, they're going to go to Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh is going to be playing a third time in a row. Fourth and 22. Field goal is missed from 57 yards. That sucks for the Steelers. And all that land that they have been working for just goes straight down the drain. I did not see that coming. They had the Ravens or the Broncos? The Broncos. We going uh, to the east. I guess it's this one. I'm not taking this state. The Arizona Cardinals for the first time. Northeastish again. I think that's going to the Raiders. We'll have the Arizona Cardinals at the Las Vegas Raiders. Drive down. I think they kicked the field goal. And they win it to take over Arizona, the second win. No, they got a touchdown, actually. So the Raiders actually have a pretty good spot now here, too. And we picked the Raiders again. So the Raiders will be battling another time. Will they battle the Chargers? No, they'll go. They'll obviously play the San Francisco 49ers. This is for a big piece of land as well. Jesus Christ. Yeah, end their suffering, please. 40 to 16, the 49ers went. The 49ers will take over the Raiders' huge land and become probably the most owned land in the United States. When we have 16 teams left, we will spin again. This time, it will land on the Atlanta Falcons. I, I do think we got the Atlanta Falcons once, but I think they just expanded and didn't have to battle anybody do i have to battle anybody now let's see i think they just do hit this open land i think it actually clips the colts land here so they have to be battling the colt it'll be a tough task since the colts have won so many games but if they do win and pull off the upset i mean hey they have a huge piece of land to start off here and 33 to 31 is your final score congratulations colts imagine if the colts are the last team standing out of all these teams we have the indianapolis colts it will get a new team either way it is going to be the new england patriots these are in a weird position as well does that go to new york it'll be the patriots at the new york giants that'll be it for them the giants get knocked off the map in their second game the new england patriots win they their spot over 49ers yep it is that way but they'll just claim this land we have a lot of just unclaimed land at this point then we'll have the green bay packers that way i think they might have been saved by the vikings here we switch the vikings aren't an easy game either yeah the vikings absolutely obliterated the packers and the vikings take over green bay tampa bay buccaneer kind of straight down i'm pretty sure that's going to be against the dolphins it is dolphins get the ball back and score a touchdown though and i think that'll do it yes it does so we will say goodbye to the bucks can we get a team that hasn't been picked yet the eagles i don't think the eagles have been picked they are in a weird situation let's see which way they go 
straight down. I think that'll go to the Ravens. Yes, it will. And the Ravens knock off the Eagles in their first game, 35 to 25. Sorry, Eagles, but goodbye. This is going to be the Baltimore Ravens that just had their very first game. Will they win two in a row? They'll be going pretty much straight up. I think that's going to the Patriots. We'll say... Might go to the Colts, but I'm, I'm going to guesstimate here and say the Patriots. Yep, okay, that's going to be it. The Patriots beat the Baltimore Ravens 38-21. to So, goodbye Baltimore and hello Minnesota. Beating the Green Bay Packers, which way are they going here? Pretty much straight up. So, they'll be going to Indianapolis to take on the Colts. And the Vikings take over a huge chunk of land. Jesus Christ, look at all of that land they just got. Back to the wheel, we have the Chiefs. The Chiefs have only played... When to, actually, I don't think they played any. I think they just took over some territory that wasn't claimed. I think it's actually pointing to this land. They'll take over this little spot of land here. Next is going to be the LA Chargers. Well, they have to battle the 49ers. I mean, I mean, look at it. Do we even really need to spin the wheel? And it looks like the Chargers are going to take this one home and gain a fourth of the United States. And like, look at this. That, that's that's basically a cheat code for them to just play one game and have all of this land. Chargers fans, y'all waited a long time to strike, but you waited till the right time to strike. Is it the Chargers again? <gasps> nope, it's going to be the Cowboys. I think you're going to see a lot of teams just start picking up states that are unclaimed now because we still have a lot of that. Hey, actually, no, they have to take on the Chiefs. 27 to 18 and the Kansas City Chiefs will win the game. They have taken over the Cowboys land. Have a total of seven teams now. Next is going to be is it the Dolphins or the Chiefs. It is going to be the Dolphins. I think the Dolphins will only play one game and that was the Battle of Florida. Uh, this way, it's going to be towards the ocean, but what's going to be the closest? That's going to be Minnesota. If they win this, they'll have a huge piece of land. All right, the Dolphins, let's see if they can get a field goal to, to win this game, actually. They are in field goal range with 11 seconds left. They get a touchdown with nine seconds left to win this game and get a huge piece of land. This is massive for the Dolphins. I should have actually clicked and let us watch it, but I didn't know that they were going to, like, Get down the field that quick. Next, oh, I need to take Vikings off. It's going to be the Car my Carolina Panthers. All right, it's going to be the Chargers next. And they'll be going to the right here. Obviously, I mean, that's the only place they can go. Um, To take on Denver, I think. Yeah, that, that's got to be taken on Denver. And the field goal is good to go up by one point. A very close game, but the Chargers hold out to keep their land. The Chargers have expanded their land, and good gracious, so oh mighty, it's a lot. We have the Panthers, Chargers, Patriots, Chiefs, and Dolphins left. It'll land on the Chiefs. Which way will they be going? They'll be going to the left here, and they'll have to go against the Chargers. About a minute left to be fourth and ten. Patrick Mahomes pass is thrown away. The Chargers will have it first and 10, and they so knock off the Chiefs, the highest rated the team in Madden, I'm pretty sure. Don't hold me to that, but I'm pretty sure. Not making any moves at all at the beginning of the game. And now they just, just look at the map. I mean, I don't really have to say anything, do I? The Panthers, they can't claim any more land around them. It's going to go kind of upwards. We'll say the Patriots then, since it's, yeah, it's going to land on the Patriots. 31 to, I don't even remember what the final score was, but still probably last in the amount of land, but they're doing a lot better now. So if it's the Chargers selected, they're going to go into Miami. If the Dolphins are selected, we're going to spin the arrow here. The lands more to the left, they're going to the Chargers. The lands more to the right, they're going to the Panthers. Looks like they're going to Carolina here. And the Dolphins will beat the Carolina Panthers. The Dolphins and Chargers are the last two teams standing in the United States. I'm going to spin the wheel and whoever it lands on is going to be the away person. So we can go ahead and figure out that out. So we're going to have the Dolphins going into the Chargers to see who is the NFL Imperialism Champion. The championship game is underway in LA. All right, the Chargers score first three. Oh, now the Dolphins score and the Chargers score again. 10-7 Chargers 
Four minutes left in the second quarter. The Chargers score again to go up 17-7. The Dolphins score to go up. I mean, the Dolphins score then to go up. I mean, they're tied, 17-17. I'm going crazy right now. Chargers score up by a touchdown here. The Dolphins score again. This is a very close championship game. The Dolphins have the ball back. It'll be first and 10. He's sacked. Third and 15, fourth and 10. They'll kick a field goal to go up by three. Let's see if the Chargers can get in the field goal range. They can. I think. Second and one on the zero yard line. It's a rushing touchdown by the Chargers. They're up by four. The Dolphins need a touchdown here to win. Chargers score again. Wow. Okay. I mean, I, I don't mind the Chargers actually winning there. And there you go. The United States of America is covered in Chargers blue. Thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. It's been a pleasure. You guys out next time. Peace.